Good morning and welcome to day two aboard the Carnival Panorama. My family and I decided to decorate our doors. We have some fun flamingos for the girls and killer whales for the boys. And of course we had to include Grogu hanging from the outside of the hallway. The next stop is the Vista restaurant for our first sea day brunch. Seating is randomly assigned so it was really cool to have this ocean view for the first meal of the day. As you can tell, breakfast was a success. While out at sea, we decided to explore the ship a bit to see what it had to offer, and we spent some time in the clubhouse playing a few rounds of ping pong. While we were pros at ping pong, soccer style pool was a different story. After winning that match of foosball, we went ahead and checked out the sky course, and while I couldn't record during, you can see it was really intense. Intense enough to bring forth our next drink at the Serenity Bar. One thing led into another, we went shopping, we went eating, and we took a fat nap. You know the nap is good when you wake up with marks on your face. We took that lazy energy to a comfy spot to watch our favorite movie at the moment, Puss in Boots. A few drinks more and a movie later, we head back to the room only to find this cute little puppy towel animal and get ready for our first elegant night. With our bellies full, we head on over to our now favorite spot on the ship, the Havana Bar. After enjoying some music, we attended the Broadway show at the Liquid Lounge. The show was really entertaining, showcasing great vocals and dance performance. Afterwards, we grabbed a quick bite at the Carnival Deli and decided to check out the commotion at the atrium. Everyone's here. At this point, we're all pretty tired, but decided to test our luck anyways at the casino. This was my first time playing at a casino despite being 22 years old, and hey, beginner's luck. I slept real good this night. That's all I have for day two. Go on over to part three for more.